Let me see. I'm fairly certain you can just... Like, look, you can... Get off my foot! No, no, you can't roll jump that. For some reason, I thought you could roll jump across to that next one. Like, there was a platform there, but you're... You can't. Ooh. Uh, welcome back. We're back. Hey, so, who you uh, got in the Super Bowl, Matt? I got... Who you win? Who I'm, you want? I think win. the Lakers who you want this year. Who you want win? Who you want? I think Derek Jeter's gonna really show up. And he's gonna take down... The Pistons. <laughs> I, for the life of me... Peepees. I was like, I already did basketball. I already did baseball. Name a hockey team, and I named the basketball team. <laughs> I mean, because who the fuck knows hockey? I was like, what is the name of the Detroit hockey team? The Pistons. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Isn't that funny that the, the Detroit basketball team, the Pistons, used to be called the Bullets? Because Detroit just got shot up all the time. Nice. <laughs> They're like, we need to change your name. Like, well, what else? <laughs> Do you remember the the joke Mater has and Lightning McQueen? He did Martin his cup. That one. That's our team. <laughs> the pissed on cups. I like that joke actually. Well, this, is a good, this is a good joke. I think it's funny. He did Martin his cup. That's the uh, one of the Larry the three guy. redeeming qualities of the Cars franchise. Can you name them all? Larry the guy. <laughs> That's one. <laughs> no, it's it's a uh, wow. Shaboom. Wow. Life is a highway. Wow. He did one his cup. Wow. Only redeeming. Oh shit! Wow. Four redeeming qualities. Wow. The fact that Owen Wilson be a voice actor with his fucked up amazing nose. Wow. Wow. And then they made a, a sequel where it was spies. And then they made a sequel where it was Rocky. I never watched the... The third one? Ah, fuck! I'm an idiot. I don't there's, know what I was There's thinking. a scene in the third one where, where Lightning McQueen goes into, like, a, a Lightning McQueen uh, museum of awesomeness. Mm -hmm. And he says, wow. Wow. He says it just like that. He goes, what? He goes, wow. I have one. They quite literally they were like, for the third one, just do the meme. And they're like, okay. But then it's just Rocky, like all a combination of the different Rocky movies. Because they have like the him training on the beach with whatever to fight. And they keep doing that. Like, do you remember whichever the Rocky one with uh, Ivan Drago? Ivan Drago. That yeah. one. Uh, they have like a scene where he... They just keep cutting back like between them and Rocky's like lifting wood in Russia mm. and the other guy's just like punching like a some kind of sensor and numbers just keep going up and you're like, I don't know if that's good or not, but he's the numbers keep getting bigger. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They just did that in this movie, except it was like Lightning McQueen was in like a destruction derby and then it cuts back to the guy and he's racing on like a VR racetrack <laughs> and like his time just keeps getting faster and you're like, he's getting faster. Wow. And then you're just like, but Lightning McQueen is, is training the in the woods, so he'll, he'll be better on the racetrack. He knows how to dodge trees. That'll help on the completely treeless racetrack. I don't know. Do you, uh, so, so I think that the future might have like some cool things. Like, uh, I, I'm looking forward to professional pod racing. Just saying. Like, I think that'd be a cool thing to actually watch. If people like legitimately die in it. Fuck yeah, dude. That'd be awesome. Like, I don't know. Like when people die NASCAR. in NASCAR, it's fucking sad. Well, NASCAR is fucking boring. They need something exciting. People go just to watch the car accidents, and then Dale Earnhardt died, and everyone went, Dale! Yeah. And then his son was like, I'm gonna race. It was still the most exciting thing that ever happened to NASCAR. The Ricky Bobby. You remember when he was like, I'm on fire. Oh, Ricky Bobby. <laughs> Do you remember when, when he up. went and, and he he was he thought he was handicapped and he went to Michael Clark Duncan and he was like, I wish Why you... are there so fucking many of these things? I don't know. Are you supposed to turn something off? I don't fucking know. I think Did they just keep turn spawning. off the faucet. <laughs> that these they left the water running. Fucking get away from me. I think me. they just keep fucking spawning. Fucking creepy rat. 
Yeah, they just keep spawning. Oh they my keep god, coming out of that thing. this is some fucking shit. You have to turn it off. Yeah, I see that now. And then Michael Clark Duncan's there, and then he's like, he's like, I hope you have beautiful boys. And then God takes their legs away, and he goes, Don't put that on me. Nope, I don't uh, remember. The fair part. And then he stabs him with a knife. Good. As long as people get stabbed. Michael Clark Duncan was cool. Remember when he was Kingpin? Yeah. And then, uh, Matt, not Matt Damon. Let's see the guy. He's Batman. I don't know. Fucking. There's a couple of Matt. Name? A couple of Batman. He's the newest one. The one that. Ben Affleck. Ben Affleck. That's his name. He's not Batman anymore. He was. Sure. Yeah. He's not anymore. Neither's uh, Henry Cavill. I mean, he was never Batman, but he's not Superman. Kind of sucks. I kind of like Henry Cavill. I liked him as Superman. Well, I mean, just because Superman is the most like brain dead fucking like you could. Can... Um, muscular white guy. I liked, I liked, I haven't seen Mission Impossible Fallout, but I like his mustache in Mission Impossible Fallout. And at the end of the day, if it was either he has a mustache in Fallout or in Justice League, he doesn't have a weird mouth, mm -hmm. I'd still go with the Fallout mustache. Yeah. I mean, he should just grow out the full ass beard for, 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 for Justice League. Yeah. I think his beards are cool. And I think that he looks particularly good with the beard. Ooh, it's a fucking meal. A snack and a half. Almost like this guy. Look at this guy's mustache. What are your names? He frightens me. I don't know what he's saying. He's I'm got like scared. lava for his uh, overalls. See? That is weird. Look at his gross toes. Ew. Could you imagine training your toes to be spread that far? I can't imagine. No. I, I really can't. Gotta say, how many toes do you think you can fit in your mouth? I don't know. Maybe, maybe one day I'll have a definitive answer for you. You ever, you ever just think about that? Because I got a big mouth. I could probably fit. I got a whole foot in my mouth. You know, Matt, I gotta say, I don't think that ever, 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 cannot stress. Ever. I don't think I've ever thought about that. Haven't? Okay. Yeah, so like the the channel I watch, Funhouse, there's one guy on there who has just like an enormous mouth. Okay. His name's Lawrence. Strange boast, but alas. Yeah. Uh... And they were, they were talking, like, someone, they did, like, a comment show or whatever where they would react to comments. And one of the comments was, like, wow, Lawrence, you have a huge mouth. And he goes, yeah, I think I can fit my whole fist in my mouth. And then, like, he did it on the, the thing. Mm -hmm. And I was, like, I've got a similarly shaped mouth, like, size-wise. His is a little bit bigger than mine. Wonder if I can do it. Absolutely can. Did you really put your whole fist <laughs> in your mouth? Yeah. That's disgusting. I know. <laughs> yeah. I got a, I got a fucking... That's weird. Big move. It's a weird thing to say. Yeah. It's a weird thing to look at Jerry's about. You're just a weird, you're a weird guy. Yeah. Get blast egg. It's fine. Right on top of it. Yeah! Awesome. You've literally missed like so many, like throughout the normal, like the level as it is. Why would you go back for that one? It's not like that was. It was important to me. Okay. It's my wife. I took all of his friends. I didn't want to just leave them alone. I wonder how lonely they'd be. Yeah. Just fucking sitting like above this. Void. Uh, camera? Oh, I didn't even get it. Shit. That's weird. Why didn't it give it to you? I don't fucking know. Is it because you died? I don't know, dude. Give me eggs. Shit, it's a fucking bar. Are you serious? And you can't Whoa. just, like, you can't, jump like, across. There. Yeah, you gotta... You have to launch yourself. That's, you needed it anyways. Whoa. Maximum... Maximum egg. Blue. You're out of blue. I'm out of blue. Find more blue. blue. Yeah. Blue. You might not have enough blue to get across. I don't have enough blue. Luckily, they give to you. Yeah, but if they don't blue. give you a blue for each jump, oh, nice. <laughs> Check it out. Uh huh. Check it. I'm checking it. That's okay. Speed run incoming. Here I go. Yeah. I thought you fell right off. <laughs> I would never do such a thing. Go. You probably skipped this part. 
Can I make that one? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Can I hit that one? Yeah, you know, first I doubted your your speed run ability. But uh you know now I'm I'm not I think you might actually be the the best Jack and Dexter player ever. This side of the Mississippi. Just this side? Well, there's one fucking Korean kid that's really good. He lives right on the Mississippi border, though. Two fucking Koreans. Provide to me a girlfriend, please. <laughs> hey, what's up? I'm yellow, man. Also, Sin City, uh, there's, a, there's, a, there's a character um, known as the Yellow Bastard. No, it's Asian? not racist. He's not Asian. He's a white guy. Um, I don't know. Okay, so... I fucking, he makes me so uncomfortable. I've been thinking about his face since I saw this yesterday. But, um, so at the beginning, he just looks like a dude, right? Yeah. And he's a... He's a he's a child rapist. He's a, he's a, Ooh, he's a so he's a man. really good character. No. He's a molester man. And, um... Yeah, a good character. Um, I don't understand. What? What? He's a molester man, right? Yeah. And so Bruce Willis uh, shoots his dick off. Good. Like, fucking son of a bitch. We, we've established that you have a, a strong hatred for pedophiles. Good. And would murder them. I would. If you were Spider-Man. I was Spider-Man. <laughs> but only I if would. you were Spider-Man. I would. If you were the Punisher, you wouldn't. I mean, if I... Well, the Punisher is just a dude with a gun, but he's also, like, really good with a gun. Uh-huh. I'm... I, I, I'm, I technically could be like, yeah, I'm going to be the Punisher one day. I probably wouldn't be very good at it. People who wear Punisher merch scare me. Yeah, that, it, that's a weird thing to wear. Like, it's a it's a pretty cool comic. And the, the Netflix series is fucking super cool because the action scenes are really nice. And mm -hmm. they, they aren't limited by like, oh, it's a Marvel movie, so we can't show blood and no mm -hmm. one can die. Oh, yeah, no, I watched it the other day. Uh, there's a part when... um. I think it's in the second season, first season. I don't know. Mm -hmm. But uh, I, I haven't watched the whole series, so I, I, by all means, I don't, I don't know what's happening. Yeah. But um, they go like, uh, this is when he's still in the army, and then they go on a mission, and then uh, uh, there's like a government guy who like set him up. Or he was like, he's like, I, I, I pointed, so now you go shoot. I don't know if you remember that line. Mm -hmm. But um, and so they go and they, they, they. They they kill the target that they were going for, uh -huh. but they like lost like half of their men. Yeah. And then the guy was like, "Well, did you kill the target?" And fucking straight up, uh, the Punisher punches his fucking eye out. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. That was fucking awesome. Yeah. There. Uh, did you watch Daredevil season two? No, I didn't watch okay. any, of, any of it. So that he's introduced in Daredevil season two, mm -hmm. and there's a scene where it's just like, uh, he gets locked up in prison at the same time as as Kingpin. Mm -hmm. The Punisher, and it's just an all it's like a five minute all out brawl where mm -hmm. it's like everyone in the prison is on Kingpin's side and they're all attacking him down like this one hallway. Mm -hmm. Daredevil fucking loves fighting in hallways, all the fight scenes are in hallways, and all of them look fucking amazing. Mm -hmm. Um, it's the most like just bloody, disgusting thing ever, but it's so well choreographed. Mm -hmm. Like at the start of it, it's just the the uh Punisher in like a white prison uniform, and by the end. Like, his face is all, like, bruised up. You, yeah, you can I've see, like, it's closing, and he's just, like, covered in blood. I've seen the scene, especially. I've seen it compared with the comics. It's in yeah. the comics. I think that's the comic book cover. Um, very very good. It, uh, um, that, that scene is the comic book cover, and um, the blood makes his symbol on his on the chest. Yeah. It looks really cool. Super cool. Uh, love the show. Uh, sadly, it won't be continuing because Disney, because Disney bought it up. Well, it might, it might continue on the Disney streaming service, but not on Netflix. Um, what was I going to say, though? Uh... Oh yeah, we're talking about the people that wear Punisher merch are always the people where you're like, they're like the really quiet kid that's wearing like steel-toed combat boots, and they have just like the belt buckle, and you're like, this frightens me. It's never just like some random kid that's like, you, yeah, you, ne you never comic. look at it and be like, yeah, I love comic books, or you know what I mean? It's just frightening. It's like I feel like there have been times when I'm like, so you watch the Punisher, and he's like, what? No. And I'm like, do you, do you know the Punisher? And he's like, just like the symbol. And you're just like, all right. Nice. Do you want to come to my house and look at my guns? Have and you're nice like, oh my god. <laughs> Have a nice day, dude. Oh, shooting green juice. I think this is the last fight, so... 
<coughs> want to finish this episode? Because I don't think there's an 18 minutes left of a... I don't know. No, we'll, we'll, hold on. Look, he, have you noticed that he's just got balls hang, just dangling? Does he wear? Watch. Hold on. Watch. Hold on. Cut back to the fucking balls. Watch. There's like three balls. They're just dangling underneath his Yeah. Seat. That's weird. Maybe what it's like the purpose a of them? prison chain. No, because he used to be the sage. One of the sages. Yeah, but now he's a bad guy. So he went to jail. No. Most bad guys. Why is the guy who got to use jail? dark ego the bad guy? Get your fucking just all of Come your on. fucking you fucking snowflake. Get that shit Come out of here. Come on, dude. Dark ego. Jack would never hit a black shirt. <laughs> he said, "Book on go." <laughs> I'm gonna rule it. <laughs> like, I've literally been walking around punching things in the face. What the fuck am I gonna do? Jack, the elevator's out of order. Take the stairs. <laughs> Alright. Next time, we're gonna go do that. What do you mean, next time? I mean, next time! This fight's gonna be over. NEXT TIME!